News Channel Lines Callahan Marshall spoke with a local restaurant owner who says all restrictions need to be lifted in order for them to have a chance at recovering from the pandemic. While many New Yorkers were celebrating, Marty Richardson was sitting back watching. Because I feel like people get the impression that it's like some kind of win for us, but it isn't because it doesn't really change anything for us at all, and, and it's just frustrating. She owns three restaurants in central New York. Despite capacity restrictions being lifted, bars and restaurants still have to social distance. I think they really need to take away the six-foot rule for, for it to make any difference for us, for us to go back to normal and to be able to see like our full capacity. Richardson says it costs about $100 to make each one of these, and with there still being some restrictions on bars and restaurants, she says it's hard for them to be able to afford some of this equipment. With that six foot rule still intact, they would need to buy more dividers to put in between each of the tables if they want to be at full capacity. Unless we're going to invest like some insane amount of money in like making these, you know, dividers and the dividers take room and and we do that, but it that takes away table space and less table space means less people and less people means less money for us. It's a battle she can't seem to win. And we've taken such a hit for over a year now and it's like throw us a bone. And they're tired of begging. In Syracuse, Callahan Marshall, News Channel 9. Well, with the restaurants allowed to have parties of 10, Richardson says some of them have turned into vaccine parties.